writing equivalent fractions. Let's review. Equivalent fractions have different numerators and denominators, but they name the same amount. Here we have one half of a pizza, two fourths of a pizza, and four eighths of a pizza. All of these fractions represent the same amount of pizza. They are equivalent fractions. To write an equivalent fraction, just multiply or divide the numerator and denominator by the same number. For example, if I want to create a fraction that's equivalent to one half, I just need to multiply the numerator and denominator by the same number. You can pick whatever number you want. I'm gonna multiply by two. One times two is two, and two times two is four. I could have multiplied by five and gotten five tenths. I could have multiplied by a hundred and gotten one hundred two hundredths. If I multiply the numerator and denominator by the same number, it will have an equivalent fraction. I could also divide to make the numerator and denominator smaller. This is a little trickier because I have to choose a number that both of these can be divided by evenly. Four and six are both divisible by two, so let's divide them both by two. That's a common factor. Four divided by two is two, and six divided by two is three. So four sixths and two thirds are equivalent. Why does this work? What happens when you multiply a number by one? The number stays the same. The value doesn't change. This is called the identity property. What happens when you divide a number by one? The number stays the same. Once again, the value doesn't change. Remember that any fraction with the same numerator and denominator is equal to one. Four fourths, that's just one whole. So multiplying or dividing the numerator and the denominator of a fraction by the same number is the same as multiplying or dividing by one. The value doesn't change. Let's look at that example from earlier. We multiplied the numerator by two and the denominator by two to create an equivalent fraction. Multiplying the numerator and denominator both by two is the same as multiplying the fraction by one. I'll show you. One half times two over two, which is what we did, equals two fourths. But remember, two over two or two halves is just one. We really just multiplied by one and that is why the value stays the same. Just remember, to write an equivalent fraction, Multiply or divide the numerator and denominator by the same number. This video was created by La Fontaine of Knowledge. Check the link in the description for lesson materials that go along with the video. And subscribe to my channel for more videos like this.